going to insert an image into a web page. Now, the web page is saved in my downloads folder. Okay, and uh, here you can see the web page. This is my HTML page, as you can see. Uh, and here is my image. So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to edit the web page. I'm going to use Notepad Plus Plus today. And here is my web page. Okay, so I'll just put this over here. And uh, this is my web page. You can see the tags. Here's my head tag and my body tag. Okay. And if you have a read through, one of the things you should see is here it says there should be a picture of an orangutan here. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of that. And inside here, I'm going to put my picture. Okay, so hopefully you remember from our lesson that we use that image tag to put in an image. Uh, and the most important thing when we put in an image is we need to tell the computer where it can find the image. So we need to tell it the source of the image. So we're going to write SRC, which is short for source, equals, and then we're going to tell the computer where it can find the image. Now the image could be on the World Wide Web, as we discussed, or it could be saved on the computer. Okay? In this case, our image is saved here. It's this uh, image of the orangutan. So what I'm going to put in here is I'm just going to put a quote. And then I'm just going to put the file name. So I can check the file name of this. I can right click. I can go to properties. Uh, and I can see that the file name is orangutan.jpg. It tells me it's jpg in the brackets there. Okay, so I'm going to click OK. And I'm going to go back to here. So in there, I'm going to put image source equals. And I'm going to put orangutan. Okay, I've just spelled it wrong. I need to make sure I don't spell it incorrectly. I have also need to make sure that... Uh, I've used the correct upper and lowercase letters. All right, so I need to make sure that's exactly right. And there we go. I've missed out the T. All right, and then dot, and then we said JPG. Okay, and then we put the quote on the end, and we end with a triangle bracket, uh, and that should uh, insert the image, the orangutan image, into my web page. So I can save this, and then I can double click on this, and there's the image in my web page. Okay, so that's how to add an image that's stored on your computer into your web page. Thank you for watching.